Serena Williams may have been an exceptional tennis player, but her behavior on and off the court has raised concerns about her role as a model for aspiring athletes. Despite her incredible achievements, many argue that she set a poor example for young players and others in the sport. One notable instance is her entitled and aggressive demeanor, which some observers feel has negatively influenced younger players. This mentality appears to have manifested in 20-year-old American Coco Goff. While Goff has shown remarkable talent and potential, her conduct, at times, mirrors the less desirable traits associated with Williams. Aside from Jessica Pagula, the entire female Olympic tennis team has been criticized for their poor sportsmanship and perceived disgrace to the American flag. The behavior of these athletes has sparked a broader conversation about sportsmanship and national representation. Coco Goff, in particular, seems to exhibit a victim mindset. Along with her Olympic teammates, she has struggled to handle losing with grace. This lack of sportsmanship is not just an issue within the realm of tennis. It reflects a broader concern about the current state of American sports culture. Role models play an important role in inspiring young athletes. When prominent figures in sports fail to demonstrate humility, respect, and grace in both victory and defeat, it sets a troubling precedent. Young players look up to these stars, and their behavior can shape the attitudes and actions of the next generation. Moreover, this issue extends beyond tennis. The way athletes conduct themselves on the international stage can influence perceptions of their country. Poor sportsmanship not only affects the individuals involved but also the image of the nation they represent. In light of the outrageous and disrespectful behavior of the women's American Olympic tennis team, we see why it's crucial to promote positive role models in sports who exemplify the values of integrity, respect, and good sportsmanship. Athletes like Jessica Pagula, who demonstrate these qualities, should be celebrated and emulated. We need to encourage a culture that values graciousness in both victory and defeat. It's time to shift the focus towards athletes who inspire not only through their tennis skills but also through their character. Should we encourage a culture that values graciousness in both victory and defeat, rather than getting a cheap thrill from tennis drama? What do you think about the current state of sportsmanship in American tennis? Do you think there's a broader issue regarding American culture or do you think these concerns are overstated? Share your thoughts in the comments below and make sure to like and subscribe for more tennis and social content. You understand that I have to take a decision, and in this case, but you I, have to be sure you can't. I am say 100 sure. No, you're I'm, not. You just said maybe I'm wrong. It's well, not based on your reaction, I, I might be wrong. But I have to take. This I decision. never argue these calls, but you called it out before I hit the ball. I understand. The temperature rising. <laughs> the passions flowing over. Coco Golf standing at ground.